Former Sally May unit um, is up for another lucrative Department of a lucrative Department of Education contract. The Department of Education is seriously considering granting a potential billion dollar contract um, to the decade long contract to the former unit of Sally May, the student loan company that the Justice Department last time we talked about on the show found them in violation of federal law for cheating soldiers. The company is called Navent Corp. Um, it is the largest student loan company and was one of the four finalists for a new contract to run its system for originating and, distri and distributing new federal loans and grants and keeping track of the existing ones. The current holder, is, it's currently held by Accenture, um, is valued at $880 million as of May 2014, according to the Department of Education. If Navent wins this contract, it would have the role in originating new federal loans for borrowers and keeping track of the billions and the millions and millions of loans that are already out there, collecting monthly payments on those loans and chasing them if they go into default. In other words, borrowers' entire interaction with the Department of Education from the moment they enter the system until the moment they leave would solely be controlled by one company who, may I add, is guilty of violating federal law. This is the problem here. They pillage student loans. They pillage students. They pillage young people. They pillage families to make their profits. Pillage. And that's the right word I'm using here. Pillage. And now the Department of Education wants to give them another contract. Ladies and gentlemen, we must stand up against this. The, the, government, the, gov the government is a government of the people, for the people, by the people. And sadly, the Department of Education, I'm, I would ar also argue Arnie Duncan, is clearly for Sally Mae, by Sally Mae, for Sally Mae, from Sally Mae, by Sally Mae, created by Sally Mae. They're making billions of dollars in profits that the Department of Education is bringing in, and they now want to sign another contract with a horrible contractor.